My own definition of spirituality is a habit of being um, oriented towards a transcendent, transcendent reality, both in emotion, in thinking, and in motivation and action. And a spiritual experience would be an experiential realization or connection to such a reality, again, both in emotion and in cognition, reaching down to motivation and action. So, uh, the important thing about spiritual experience is actually the experiential course. It's not just thought, like in faith or in a cognitive um, statement, but a holistic understanding. Spiritual experience can be really said to be at the very core of uh, religious traditions. That is at least my reading and the reading of several scholars. Uh, so it would mean spiritual experiences of single persons, maybe even groups, have been uh, the originator of religions. And as each spiritual experience is also a very a broad and a, a very um, deep and general experience of a, of a full-fledged reality that cannot be expressed easily in, in simple words, what happens is that narratives are created afterwards that try to capture the experience in images, in um, paradoxical statements, even in s certain kinds of narratives that are then condensing into rituals, into morals, into uh, behaviors and into rites. And that is, I think, the generic uh, way how religions come about. And then religions start their own life and impact back on those that have experiences. They are meant to uh, make experiences easier through the ritual, through the, the rites they introduce and to also channel these and give them a kind of form.